Hello. Good afternoon, good evening, in fact, and welcome back to Inside RG Does Mastermind with your host this week. It is me, Mike. Um, I'm in the hot. I'm in the mastermind hot seat today. Um, so, without further ado, let's welcome on our uh, our special guest, uh, our player, ladies and gentlemen, Jack Wade. Hi, Mike. Hi, Jack. What an entrance. Welcome Thanks. to Inside RG Does Mastermind, your turn in the hot seat. Please tell the audience a bit about yourself, Jack. So my name is Jack. Um, I'm from Uckfield. I'm kind of a big deal. Um, I've got a, a wife called Holly, a little boy called Archie and a beautiful family. Uh, very lucky to have um, a big family around me. So, yeah, lots of lovely people. Um, that, that, that's about it. I'm 33. Um, I am a little bit older than Mike, but um, although I don't look it, so uh, yes, and I'm ready for this. Fantastic. And oh, sorry, this just coming in. Apparently, I look better in a tux than you do. Well, there we go, ladies. Thank you very much. Um, I love that. So obviously, last week uh, I ended up on 14 points. So you got 14 points to uh, to beat. Um, two rounds. General knowledge first round, 10 questions, and then 10 questions on your chosen subject, which we'll come to on a, in a minute. So Jack Wade from okay. High Hurstwood, aged 33. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? I am. Well, I'm not, but I'm going to try. OK, general, general knowledge. General knowledge quiz is I'm awful. Gen well, I mean, I, I said the Eiffel Tower was built in California last week, so I didn't do myself any favours, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. Um, all right. Okay. Question one: General knowledge. Where was the 2012 Olympic Games held? I should have, I should have known you was going to. Um, 2012. China. Okay. These are all sport questions. Just to let you know. So good luck. Oh, <laughs> Who wrote the James Bond books or novels? Ian Fleming. OK. What year was Roland Gorringe founded? 1926. You sure? Because the chairman of the company is watching. I've got nothing. 1926. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. <laughs> Sorry. OK. P P45 was that? OK, yeah, cool. Um, in <laughs> in Craig David's song Seven Days, on what day did he take her for a drink? You can sing it. I want to say Tuesday. Do you want to sing it just to check? Met this girl on Monday, took her for a drink on Tuesday. And we were making up. Yeah, Tuesday, Tuesday. I don't know. I was enjoying that. Is that great question? Great question. What is the most expensive property on a Monopoly board? English Monopoly board. How now? Mate, mate, fair? Mate, fair. OK. Name one film where Al Pacino and Robert De Niro have starred together. Eat. Okay, it's one of my favourite films. Oh, me too. This is my favourite. This one is coming from our esteemed colleague Adrian Baxter. Oh God! Name name the six teams that make up the six nations in rugby union. England, Ireland, Scotland, Wales, France, and Italy. Wow. I'm not giving anything away, but wow. <laughs> Which date is it considered to be the official Star Wars day? Which date? May the 4th. <laughs> this one's especially for you. Name two of the Kardashian sisters. Oh, okay. Any? Kim and Kim and Chloe. I bet you can name the other one as well. Yeah, of okay. <laughs> No, I'm joking. I can't. He's smashing. Finally, question 10. Which football team 
plays their home games at the Amex Stadium. Brighton. Right. And that uh, completes. You took me there. I did take you there. That completes your ten general knowledge questions. Thanks, Mike. Round two, everybody. Jack, your specialist subject, please. Harvey's beer. This is a Harvey's glass, but it's been overused. Hence, it's now going. This is a pint of Olympia. We will, so, we will take your word for it. So Harvey's Brewery in Lewis, nice local connection, is your uh, is your chosen subject. So before we get on to that, tell us a bit about your estate agency career. How did you end up at Roland Gorringe? So um, how did I end up at Roland Gorringe? Well, I, I, I did a estate agency at um, work experience when I was 14. I uh, went into a little estate agent in a village called Highs. It was um, Neelam Estates was the name of the estate agents. And um, I fell in love with it. Loved wearing a suit, loved feeling important and not actually knowing anything. Um, I know probably the same amount now that I, I did when I was 14. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I just really fell for it. And then um, went to, to uni in Brighton, um, did quite a, a number of jobs and then ended up back in a state agency um, about eight or so years ago um, and found a home at RG. Um, best estate agency I've ever worked for and um, I, won't, I won't ever be leaving. Yes. Well, we'll decide that, Jack, but uh, moving on. Um, oh, you're welcome. Um, so, round two, Harvey's Brewery then. OK, are you ready? I think so. Hang right. on. <laughs> I'm ready. We waiting for that one day. Question okay. one. When was Harvey's founded? Oh. Which year? Sorry, which year was Harvey's founded? Sorry. 1790. The Harvey's Imperial Extra double stout is what percentage? Seven and a half percent, nine percent or twelve percent? Seven and a half. How many pubs does the brewery have? Forty five in total. <laughs> In the Upfield, in Roland Gorringe Upfield branches patch, so our patch, how many Harvey's pubs are there? In our patch? In our, in, in the, in our Upfield Roland Gorringe patch, mate. Oh, well, there's the Alma in Upfield. That's the only Upfield one. The Pig and Butcher in, um, actually, is the Pig and Butcher a Harvey's pub? Yeah, I think it is. You've got the Black Boys in. You've got the one in Isfield, the halfway house, Rose Hill. And then we push on to the Ashdown Forest, don't we? And then you've got the... Oh, I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with five. Okay. But then just RG, just RG Upfield, yeah? Just RG Upfield, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna RG, go... RG, RG Lewis would have been a bit of a harsh question. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to go with five in our patch. OK, and my, my question five is going to be name them, but you've just named them. So that, that's, oh. that's fine. OK. OK, in the aftermath of the 2000, year 2000 floods in Lewis, which yeah. caused two million pounds worth of damage to the brewery, the abandoned beer was bottled and sold under what name? In the flood. Yeah, yeah. So do you want me to repeat the question? No, no, it's OK. In the fire, I know it was Bonfire Boy. In the flood. That's a good question, that may. Oh, right, I'm going to have to hazard a guess that I don't know. 2000, 2002, did you say? Uh, 2000, it's the year 2000, the floods were. So it's not an overly old beer. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm okay. not even going to guess. I'm not sure. Sorry, mate. No, you're fine. What percentage is the good old Sussex best? Four. The seasonal ale sold at the Lewis Bonfire is called what? Uh, I'm going to say Bonfire Boy, I think. Or it could be Lewis. 
No, yeah, I'm going to say Bonfire Boy. It's got to be. There's Lewis Castle Brown, but I don't think that. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay. You should get a crate of Harvey's for this. You said Harvey's like 15 times. We yeah, I'll get a free. I hope so. I mean, Harvey's is great. Do you remember? I like Harvey's. Do you like Harvey's? Um, yeah, I do. Um, my dad does. Um, I, I mean, I could reel off loads of people, so as many crates as <laughs> we can get. <laughs> All Harvey's water is filtered through which Sussex hill range? Oh, um, uh, uh, the South Downs. You sure? Yeah, no. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to just... Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Mike. And finally, the spent grains are sent to which Sussex Agricultural College after use to feed their Plum, cows? Plumpton, I think. That's in Sussex? Yeah. Okay. Jack Wade, your time on Mastermind is over. Thanks, Mike. Wow. So, thank you to everyone who watched this week's. Thank you to everyone who watched last week's. As always, um, on Saturday, tomorrow, we will post the um, post Jack's results and we will see who has won in the Jack versus Mike Mastermind. Um, quick question, please comment below. Do I look more like James Bond or Manuel from 40 Towers? That seems to be the question of the day. Yeah. Manuel. It's Manuel. It is, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Fine. <laughs> um, thank you very much for joining us. Next week, we're going to do a different game show, so tune in for that. And we will. Uh, I hope you all have a great Easter. Jack, anything you want to say or any shout outs? Um, yeah, actually, I'll put a shout out to um, my uh, my good friend, um, Gareth, who he literally just got a crate of Harvey's delivered today because Harvey's are delivery again. If anyone doesn't know that, they are. Um, so, yeah, he just got a crate. So big shout out to him. And um, just, yes, that's, that's it. Really. Thank you, Mike. Fantastic. Thank you for watching, everyone. See you later.